first evaluate a square root before you classify it. Square root of 25 is a perfect square, so this is a rational number. But the square root of 24 does not come out evenly. We call this an irrational number. So if it's not a perfect square, it's going to be irrational. Now you do know a little about it. We know 5 squared is 25, that's too high. And we know 4 squared is 16, that's too low. So we could estimate that the square root of 24 is right up here, right before 25. If you were to work it, it would not come out evenly, and it would never end or repeat. So we call it an irrational number. The most well-known irrational number is pi. On a circle, the diameter is the distance across the circle, and it actually takes about three of those to go around a circle. It's actually a little bit more. It's about three times around. If you want to be more specific, it's about 3.14 times around or 3.1415 times around. So it takes about three of your diameters to go around, and that relationship is called pi. So pi is your circumference of your circle. You can remember this is your circumference because it looks like it's a C divided by its diameter.